Uh, another small cosmetic step here. Um, I've uh, systematically gone around and I've named each of the connectors uh, and each of the parts on this IBD. So this is the IBD microwave. So for example, if I select that connector there, I've named it um, with a sensible name for the connector. I've called it Con Button Timer. And you can see that for the um, in the properties dialog there. And I've done that for each of the connectors. Give them a more sensible name. That will make it easier for us to refer to those later on. Um, and the other thing I've done is to just ensure that all of these parts are, have a proper name based on their type. So, for example, button 1, uh, so that, that thing which is a start button, I've start stop button I've called button 1, the keypad I've called keypad 1, um, lamp I've called lamp 1, and each of that, in each case I'm defining the name within the uh, properties window there. Um, the, the point of having the, uh, the number on the end is just of course that you could have multiple um, uh, you know, lamps, multiple motors if you like. Let's just finish this off by renaming the timer. Okay, so now each of those parts are, are named and we can refer to them later. And uh, here's a zoomed in view of the internal block diagram just so you can see all of those names. Um, uh, I've set this up, as you recall, so that the connector labels are not shown, but um, you can see all the, all the other names here. Uh, I think that's reasonably explicit.